Well, a really interesting aspect of this leadership race for the next Tory leader and Prime Minister, of course, is that Liz Truss backed Remain, campaigned for Remain back in 2016, came out recently and refreshingly just said plainly that she got it wrong. And I know a number of you, you know, were supportive of the fact that she just came out and admitted that. Rishi Sunak, by contrast, uh, back leave, voted leave. Seems a bit of a low profile uh, leave campaigner, it must be said. But nevertheless, it's a situation, this leadership contest, where, as the latest YouGov polling of the Conservative membership shows, there's a big split between Remain voting Tory members and Leave voting Tory members. So you see there that about 73% of Conservative members who voted Remain back in 2016 are actually back in Rishi Sunak. But 70% of those who voted Leave in 2016 uh, in the Tory party are back in Liz Truss. And of course, that isn't an even split because there are a lot more Leave voting Conservatives than there are Remain voting Conservatives. Hence, Liz Truss being way ahead in the race and of course she's had some heavyweight Brexiteer endorsements like Jacob Rees-Mogg and Lord Frost and now Liz Truss coming out pledging to ditch uh, EU laws to scrap remaining EU laws a bonfire of EU red tape being pledged uh, Liz Truss quoted as saying as Prime Minister I would unleash the full potential of Britain post Brexit and accelerate plans to get EU law off our statute books so we can boost growth and make the most of our newfound freedom outside of the EU. She said, EU regulations hinder our businesses and this has to change. In Downing Street, I will seize the chance to diverge from outdated EU law and frameworks and capitalise on the opportunities we have. Let me know what you make of Liz Truss's pledges here to abolish EU rules. Are you backing Truss over Sunak? Let me know in the comments below. Do check out my Brexiteer bulletin. I will put a link in the top pinned comment. Do go and check that out, guys. And of course, as ever, cheers for watching.